Oh, salamat. Uh, gives me a lot of uh, excitement, of course, as a coach. No? I like uh, coaching younger guys, younger players. That's why uh, I'm really excited uh, to really start uh, training. All right, Coach Nash, a lot of fans are actually um, waiting for this. Your matchup with Coach Olsen Yersela, how <laughs> excited are you for this? Uh, yeah, of course, very excited. Um, I'm sure uh, Coach Olsen feels the same way. Um, just, just a couple of days ago, he just reminded me about our only confrontation as uh, both, both of us being head coaches. No? Mm -hmm. And he reminded me that uh, he's leading 1-0 to zero now against me. Well, you know what? Oh, I mean, there are more meetings there for sure. Oh, konting trash tukan na. But then uh, now looking at the the group that you're taking over, your organization taking over, Shempre, we have no clue whatsoever of how most of these schools are doing heading into uh, a UAP season. Can you tell us a bit about your program ngayon and uh, where you are all at in terms of getting ready for the upcoming season? Well, Paolo, you have no clue. Uh, I don't have any clue as well. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I haven't really met them, uh, uh, and uh, have training with them. Mm -hmm. But because um, you know, we're very limited right now. But uh, I was really very fortunate uh, the last uh, month to be able to at least visit some of them, visit the the players in the dorm. Mm -hmm. So because I said, "Ang ang favorite ko is really building relationship yeah. with." A lot of my players, so I, I really want to spend time with them. Kahit na we still have uh, so much limitation in terms of practices. No, absolutely, coach. And uh, I know that major limited yung interaction yung so far, and no real time to actually practice on the court together. But when you were hired to be coach, what was the vision that uh, you pitched to the management that you were trying to create, the culture that you're trying to create, Tito Adamson? Well, number one, Jigor, the most important thing is really putting emphasis on education. No? Uh, that's what I like doing. Um, and, and we initially, we really reminded them that um, they are um, student athletes. So before really thinking about basketball, make sure we are all eligible for the next um, season or this March. Um, but in terms of basketball, uh, I really see a lot of potential with uh, the players that we have. Coach Renren will really knows a lot of them. Um, sabi nga niya, um, we have a good, a really good um, set of point guards no, in uh, Lastimosa and Sabandad. So hopefully they could uh, really uh, make things uh, a lot lighter for me as a coach. Coach, how about your philosophy? I know you signed a long-term deal here. Um, with Adamson, and you're really known to be a coach that really believes in developing the players long term. Yeah, I just hope uh, Adamson will be really patient with me. Um, I, I'd like to develop uh, young men, uh, young players, and hopefully with the uh, with the term that they have given me, no, the, the trust that they've given me. Of course, I want to thank Adamson for for this opportunity, you know, giving me five years uh, to develop the, the program. Well, five years to develop the program, Coach, and of course, a room wasn't built in a day. We can expect that from Adamson as well. But you know, in, in your mind, what would constitute a successful first season? Because, of course, there are already teams that people are already pegging that, okay, baka ito yung mga favorites for the Final Four. Where do you see your squad in right now? As early as now, Shempre again, haven't been able to practice. We understand that. But then what would be a successful season for you personally? All schools would want to be in the Final Four. That's, uh, that's the initial goal, of course. No? Um, that would be an achievement you know, right away if we make it to the Final Four. We know how tough the UAAP is right now with uh, established teams like um, Ateneo, La Salle, UP, you know, even, of course, FU. Um, so, uh, the modest goal for me is really to advance to the final four. All well, right, Coach, for the last question, um, what can we expect from uh, Coach Nash Rosella 
uh, in the UAP now in a different team? Ah, uh, tough, tough question, uh, <laughs> Diego. But <laughs> but uh, I just hope I could lead uh, these young guys, no, um, and really uh, help them reach their full potential. Um, I, I know a lot of them are really excited to uh, start training and represent the school. Uh, hopefully, by if if we are given, I, I'm I'm hearing that. Uh, Maybe next week uh, we will be allowed. Uh, the UAP will be allowed to start training. So hopefully I could really interact with them and see um, how it develops. 